Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new Tech Reviews and Gadgets episode where today we're reviewing a heated mouse pad and you guys are currently watching Freely. today's episode we're taking a closer look at a very interesting but yet intuitive product and this is actually a warm desk pad or a mouse pad whatever you want to call it and it's essentially like this you know a typical mouse pad desk pad that you use for your desk or your table but with this one it's actually heated you plugs into your wall or you know some sort of power source and from there it actually heats up keeping your hands warm your arms warm because sometimes when I'm working in environments that tend to be cool it's hard to kind of focus if your hands are cold or you know your arm is cold. But before we actually take a look at this product though, make sure you guys go down below and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications on to get updates and alerts when we do upload. Have any questions or concerns, leave a comment, enjoy the video, leave a like, and then also share this video out to anybody who may be interested in some sort of mouse pad. And then lastly, if you guys actually want to check out this product, get more detailed specifications about it, that kind of stuff will be down below in the description for those who are interested alongside with the link to make a purchase if you're interested in buying this exact product that we're taking a look at in this video. But right now, what we're gonna do is actually move over to the first look and unboxing portion of this video. So as you guys can see, the packaging is fairly simple. It's just a nice white box. But what we want to do is actually move this over to a secondary camera angle so you guys can have a closer shot at this product. So on the front of the box, you guys can see it just says warm desk pad, safe, technological, warm, and then you know there's some other stuff on the bottom. And overall, that's basically it actually. We do have some specifications on the bottom. I don't know if you guys can actually see or read that. So we're actually just gonna get cracking into the box because that's what we're here for. And we're gonna pull out this heated desk pad because honestly I didn't even know stuff like this existed so when I saw this I was like interested right away you guys can see the desk pad is kind of similar to the padding I already use in my videos but with this one like I mentioned it's heated this should be the top side and you guys can see we actually have a pal button and also a port that we need to actually plug into this to actually give it pow and yeah, so far it looks really decent. We do also have a user manual. We have some cautions and warnings on the bottom, but it's a very big desk pad. You know, I, like I said, it's about 31 inches and I can kind of show you guys on this camera. It's 31 inches and um, 13 inches down. So up and down it's 13 inches, but across it is 31 inches. And I like the texture design. This one is in black. I'm not sure if they have multiple colors you can get but not bad and that's basically it that comes with the packaging so I think all that's left to do is proceed with the testing and demo where we just test this out and see how it actually performs So since I am gonna test this out here, and maybe what I'll do is even test this out with my main setup in my room, um, we have to actually face this onto me, and I do apologize for it like kind of rolling. I should have probably flattened this out more, um, and so I do apologize for that, but let's kind of, there we go, do that. So this is probably the flattest I'm gonna get it in the video, but over time, obviously, it's gonna get more flat. I just need to kind of work those areas out. But let's actually go in, take our cable that they included for supplying POW, to this heated mouse pad. Plug this into extension cable that I have below me that you guys can't see. And now we'll plug the other end to this mouse pad. So why don't we actually power on this desk pad? So all you have to do is basically take your hand and push down on that power button. And you guys can see we have it in an orange or reddish kind of lighting. And this is actually our highest mode or high end mode. This is the highest temperature that this desk pad can go to. And I can tell you guys, this thing is really effective. I can really, I can feel the heat actually coming on this. Wow. And it's not like extremely hot, you know? It's not something that's gonna catch on fire. They're not gonna like, you know, push the heat to really excessive temperatures. But overall, it does heat up nicely and makes everything just feel nice, honestly. 
and you know there is like I said protection with this you know after four hours this thing's automatically gonna shut off without you having to intervene at all if you do forget to turn this off for some reason and this is also waterproof so if something spills on top of this even though electricity is going through it all you simply need to do is actually wipe it off and you should be fine you know it's not something that's going to get damaged if you spill water all over it obviously just don't avoid spilling water on the main you know component right here if I click it again there we go we have a green light now I don't know if you guys can see that I do apologize for my studio lights but we have a green light and this is like mid-range so this is like the medium temperature so it's a little bit down from the previous mode we had it at and then if I do it again we have another mode and that's actually our lowest setting which is this blue light that you'll see right now oh i just powered it off there we go that blue light is the lowest mode so this is like the lowest temperature that this desk pad can go to so there's three different modes or settings for the temperature and all you gotta do is select which one suits what your needs are and power it off you just click it again and now it is completely off with no led present but yes it's a very big desk pad it takes up a lot of space like i mentioned it is 31 inches across but 13 inches up and down and it does a really good job of actually heating up your desk so imagine if i had my keyboard my mouse or if i was working on assignments and stuff on this desk pad at least I'll be comfortable knowing that my hands aren't going to be freezing because I tend to get goosebumps all the time. So with this, I'm not going to get that experience anymore. So overall, this has definitely changed my perspective on, you know, working at a desk because I didn't even know that something like this even existed. So this is a very interesting product. And if you walk a lot in front of a desk, this can be really beneficial to you. So, one of my final opinions and remarks about this heated desk pad, mouse pad, whatever you want to call it. Well, I was really surprised. Like I mentioned earlier, I didn't even know these products existed. I didn't know there was a thing where you can actually heat up a desk pad or a mouse pad and continue to function and work perfectly on it. There is a few things I did forget to mention. You know, don't keep laptops on this. Don't keep anything that can actually easily ignite on this. Um, don't keep anything with batteries on this because, you know, over time that can mess it up. So there's just a few things that you might want to watch out for. But overall, you know, there's a lot of protection with this. It's waterproof. It has over, um, you know, over current protection, so if too much power passes through, it will prevent you from being shocked. Um, so there's a lot of protections going inside of this, you know, material. And then with all the different temperatures, the highest is actually 50 degrees Celsius. Um, the mid range is 45 and the lowest is 40 degrees Celsius. So with that said, we are gonna conclude the video right here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this tech reviews and gadgets episode. And if you guys did, make sure you go down below and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications on to get updates and alerts when we do upload. Have any questions or concerns, leave a comment, enjoy the video, leave a like, and then also share this video out to anybody who may be interested in some sort of desk pad. And then also, if you're a business owner or a company owner wanting to potentially work with me or a business increase, email is creweliteyt.com. You guys can shoot me a message if you want to potentially work with me. Or if you need photo assistance with this product, you guys can do so by reaching me out through my business increase email. And then lastly, if you guys want to check out this product or get more details and specifications about it, that kind of stuff will be down below in the description for those who are interested, alongside with the link to make a purchase if you're interested in actually buying this mouse pad, heated mouse pad, desk pad, whatever you want to call it, because there's a lot of different names for it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this tech reviews and gadgets episode. I know I've been making this episode, and I hope to see you guys all on the next episode. Clearly signing off. Thank you guys all for watching, and have a good rest of your day.